and where does where does this tape end? The tape goes the tape goes all the way around. The tape and goes off. It does not exist. Yeah, what's going on? I'm a Nintendo Game Dube. So close. So close. I'm gonna stick with it. We're sticking with it. And welcome back to my channel where I smoke marijuana and you watch me do it for some reason. And today's today's um, video is on Monday, so we do Mystery Box Mondays on Mystery Box Monday, on the Monday of Mystery Boxes. Today, today's box is Daily High Club. I didn't do the dance this time. I, sorry, if you guys enjoyed the dance, I didn't do the dance this time. But I'm feeling lightheaded already, and a lot of the time when I do those, I just get really lightheaded because <laughs> I do awkward, weird motions to make Danny not not be able to find a song that can match it. But for some reason, she always does pretty good. But boom. Dance of the week. <laughs> Good luck with that, bitch. <laughs> anyway, today's box is uh, Daily High Club. Daily High Club, if you don't know, is a monthly subscription box for stoners. They always send a really dope new glass piece and a bunch of other like little things that people like me and you would need throughout the month, like wraps or papers, lighter, shit like that. This month's theme seems to be zombies. I love zombies. They got little radioactive barrels. Maybe that's what caused them to go zombified, but there's Zombonies everywhere, designed in California. Bunch of Zomboids on the back. Uh, we actually have two kinds of mystery boxes today because the homies over at the Hemp Doctor also sent me out like a whole box of shit. So we're gonna try that as well. But first we'll open the Daily High Club box. We'll see what's in there. This is like a thing they send for creators. And then inside is gonna be a bunch of uh, packing peenies. So we're gonna go ahead and remove the packing peenies and we'll be right back. Boom, see? Now no more packing peenies. Did it. So I know a lot of channels probably do this last. We do this first, it's the glass piece. I realize everybody wants to see the glass piece. So I figure why not just, we'll do it before. That way if this is all you wanna see, you can you can head out after this, right? Um, I mean, where does where this tape end? The tape, goes, the tape goes all the way around. The tape goes off. It does not exist. I don't know what to do. I've never, usually the tape ends at some point. I need, I need a knife. I need Betty White, RIP the legend. Oh man, I miss her. She was the best. Yeah. There we go. And she comes through in the clutch and helps us get our bong open. <laughs> like the legend she is. All right, we're gonna open this up. We're gonna take it out. Ooh. 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 That's pretty cool. That's so cute. <laughs> That's cool. So it also comes with two other small bags inside. This one's gonna be a flower bowl. And this one's gonna be a nice little 45 degree nail. So if you wanna use it for dabs, you can use it for dabs. I don't know if we have any dabs in this box. If we do, maybe we'll do a dab. If we don't, we'll do some flour. Either way, we got a radioactive bucket dripping out a bunch of ooze. That's cool as shit. <laughs> and it probably doesn't glow in the dark, but it, it reminds me of something that would. You know what I mean? But I'm gonna go ahead and say it probably doesn't. Anyway, uh, this is fucking dope as shit. Let's fill it up. Let's look through this box to see what we can use. I'm sure there's something in there we can use, and we'll take a hit. Cheers. All right, let's see what these people sent me. They sent me so much stuff. So first of all, I have like already opened this and looked, because I didn't know what where it was from, because it didn't have like them on the return address. It just said THD on the return address, the hemp doctor. I mean, it makes sense now, but at the time I wasn't thinking about that. But I did notice that they sent me a bunch of like little goodies. Like this peanut butter and jelly cookie bar. That sounds amazing. And then, I mean, past that, I really haven't seen what was in here, but they sent me 
a soda, a f***ed up soda. That's so cool. They sent me this, a THCA blend grape ape indica, six and a half gram disposable. Holy f***ing shit. That's big as shit. All I saw was the word Kaya on the top. I haven't like looked through here. That's crazy. That's huge. And it's Danny's favorite color. So pretty. She'll probably take that off me. <laughs> um, what else we got in here? We got a couple of tubes, pre-rolls. Okay, this one's Dosey Dough. It's a hybrid premium THCA flower, 27.851%. And this one's Joker's Indica Dominant. Hey yo, 28.95%. We might have to smoke one of these for pay with the Patreons after, after this. All right, we also got Trippy Treats, a fruity rice bar. This is Delta 9 THC, 75 milligrams. And we got a couple more things in here. Just three more things. Two of these things are exactly the same though. And this, this is flower, apple fritter sativa. We'll try that with the bong in a second. And this is two Delta 9 peanut butter cups. Danny hates peanut butter cups, so these are all for me. <laughs> <laughs> Danny does not like Reese's. I don't know why she just doesn't, but we're gonna have to literally try all these things, which kind of sucks for me because, I mean, it doesn't suck for me. It's gonna be a great thing, but I'm only gonna be able to try like little bits of everything because I'm on a diet. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm actually down like 40 pounds at this point. I've, I, I, I haven't wanted to say it because like, I don't want to jinx myself, but I've been, I've been killing this shit. Just watching what I eat and really haven't changed much else. And I am dipping in belly size. So it's, it's great. Um, anyway, let's, let's, let's fill this up. Cause we said we were going to fill it up and we didn't fill it up. So now we got to, now we have to fill it up. Let's fill it up. Cheers. Well, not yet, but filling up. Cheers. <laughs> I use my green lighter for this to, to matchy match. Cheers. Take Danny's making me do it like this. So I don't block the whole thing with my hand for a half of a second. Oh my God, that tastes so good. Hemp Doctor, delicioso. That's lovely. Oh my goodness. That's so nice. The apple frips. Woo! I know it's actually called apple fritter. I'm just, I'm giving it a nickname. Try to keep up. <laughs> That's really nice though. I want one, one more hit. Cube dot. No! Mm. Isn't that nice? Mm. The apple frippies. I love it. I stole a bonus hit. Sorry. 33.4% THCA. 
They're killing it. So if you guys don't know about like the hemp doctor, me neither until just now, but apparently they have some pretty, pretty good flour. I haven't tried their other stuff yet, but their flour is really nice and it's all THCA flour. So it's perfectly legal. <laughs> I think I said legal. It's perfectly legal. Uh, they can ship it anywhere in the US because like I said, because it's perfectly legal. Anyway, I do want to like get back into the rest of the box, but I also want to do like just a quick taste test of all the shit that they sent me because I'm super interested, but also I'm gonna get very fed up off that. But we're gonna do that right now anyway. How off, how off diet is this about to be? I'm just trying to say. <laughs> they make the, the ingredient list really, really hard to see. Flour, I'm already fing up here. <laughs> First thing is flour. Is there soy fing oil in here too and shit? You know what? I'm just gonna have a tiny. I'm just gonna have a tiny bit, and then Danny's also gonna have a tiny bit of everything. All right. So we're just gonna try everything, just a little bit. First, first of all, let's let's get to the soda. I should have put this in the fridge. It's cherry cola flavored. It's a THC seltzer, Delta Nine. It's 50 milligrams, standard 12 ounce. You like cherry coke? I love cherry coke. Me too. So like focused on the can for there a second go. there. It's like pretty watered down tasting. Not gonna lie about it. Like I don't lie about things. No, I'm not digging that. It's it like it tastes like cherry cola and like the background and like the fizz is there and like everything's there. But also maybe I just got like a, like a defunct one. But it's also zero calories and alcohol free. But it's like it it, it tastes like if you put a little bit of cherry coke into water and then we're like passed it around to people that's but like maintained the fizziness somehow yeah that's what it tastes like to me sorry sorry i just i just don't like that one that much um yeah, we'll try this grape ape six and a half gram thing oh my god people probably really want to see like the rest of the dhc box and i'm just like eating things oh also in the bottom it came with the charger i thought i felt something knocking around in there <laughs> jesus christ this thing's huge oh. that's really nice that tastes like candy kind of mm. serves me to open up the airflow a little more but <sighs> that's nice oh it has a whole screen 100% battery, it's on high. It has high and low. That's cool, if you click three times, it switches. See how it's got a green L? Can you see that? It's got high and low, it tells you full battery percentage and everything. The screen is cool. Here, that's cool as shit. All right, you know what? We'll try the rest of the food. Actually, no, we'll try one more thing. We'll try this peanut butter bar, because I've been really, mm peanut butter and jelly bar because I've been I'm dying to try this and then we'll try the the rice krispie treat and the peanut butter cups we'll try those um in the patreon video so if you guys want to see me try those be a part of the patreon it's only a dollar now we changed it so mm. that's nice it tastes like one of those health bars but like a good one hmm I can tell there's shit in here that is um, off diet for me because it tastes like really good. <laughs> here, I just had a little bite. How much am I like? That shit tastes amazing. <laughs> You're gonna love it, take a big bite. I wanna wash it down with something, but not that. Mm. Right? That shit's good as mm. All right, now mm. we'll get back into the box. A little bit of a weird aftertaste, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. like in the back of my throat. But I feel like that's almost any edible, to be honest. <laughs> it's hard to mask. Exactly. Okay, real quick, just gonna jump in real quick. I just tried this, okay? Out of all the things I've tried here today, besides the, besides the flour, this is delicious. 
It doesn't have any aftertaste in it. It tastes like a Reese cup if, if Reese's used like different ingredients, straight up. Like if Reese's had a, a different chocolate and different peanut butter, that's what it tastes like. And it doesn't taste like weed at all. Like it doesn't taste like like anything, like anything but chocolate and peanut butter, like good chocolate and peanut butter too. But anyway, um, I, I tried that with Patreon, but I wanted to let you guys know too, because the, I mean, the Rice Krispie Treat was meant to be honest and the pre-roll, the pre-roll is pretty good, but the, this, this thing's fucking flames. Back in the box, we got this pack of Lion Rolling Circus cones, one and a quarters, and I love their packaging so much. They were like Lion Rolling Circus always has the coolest packaging and their products are really good too. But here's their cones and they always have like cool filter tips and shit. Like all the filter tips are always like different little characters and shit. Like this one's a lady and this one, this one's that same lady. This is a pack of those two ladies. Can you see the lady? It's probably hard. Did I just get all the lady? Usually it's like a bunch of different ones. Anyway. This one, this whole pack seems to just be, I guess maybe because we got her on the front and it literally has her picture on the back. But also they come with this nice little cone filler. It shows you little instructions on how to use it. You push it and it's also clown face. Uh -huh. So you can. Way further forward. Ah. <laughs> I had some of the dough in between my teeth right there. Mm -hmm. I can still taste it. It tastes really good. We have a pack of Line Rolling Circus uh, Hemp Wraps. This one's got the little clown guy on the front. I like him the most. He's he's my favorite Line Rolling Circus character. <laughs> <laughs> they have a bunch of them. They have so many. I have um, like a book of filter tips from them and they all have like different little characters on the inside like for the rolling dip and I like only use them on special occasions in October because I, I never want to run out of them. Anyway, back in the box we have a thing from um, Herb Saver. Herb Saver, thank you. I always forget what the HS stands for. I just saw it on the bottom. You're an herb saver, Danny. <laughs> this is like a grinder, I'm pretty sure. What color did we get? Oh, we got a, like an exclusive Daily High Club version. Ooh. That's cool. cool. If you don't know about herb saver, they're just basically plastic grinders. This is just a big two piece. And then in the bottom, sometimes there's like storage. I feel that it pops off. Oh, it twists, this one actually twisted off. Ooh. And in the bottom, there's like a little bit of storage so if you wanna like put some butt in there or something, you can. But that's cool as shit. I have not seen a Daily High Club version. Also, that sticker's familiar as shit. Didn't we get that last Halloween? Wasn't that like part of the theme from last Halloween? Right there? I was thinking that too. <laughs> that little guy is definitely like this was his little character, right? And this came in his box and shit. This is a little dirty. <laughs> you know what I mean? In this Daily High Club box? Oh man. In cool. in this Daily High Club box, our little friend is a zombie. Oh. I know, right? How cute is he? And his brain <laughs> comes off so you can store your weed in there. This might be one of the coolest little sidekicks that we've ever gotten because of the brain thing. That is so cool. It's all like detailed and feel cooly. You know what I mean? <laughs> Textured. Textures. Uh, anyway, only a couple more things left. We have a really tiny, cute little pink clipper lighter. We have a dube tube with nothing in it, but it's got her on the front, so it's line rolling circus, and you can put her cones in her dube tube, and... No! I pinched too hard and broke it. I cracked the back, and this is like my favorite one that I've ever had. Oh, We'll super glue it or something. Danny, super glue that and fix it. And last but not least, we got our stickers and our little bong mat. So let's see what that looks like. I'm so disappointed in myself right now. You immediately hit the Tom Haverford. <laughs> yeah, I did. Uh, we got this really cool zombie mat with the messing around and the ooze. 
It reminds me of Fallout because, like, the ooze. I was thinking that too, actually. Yeah. Because, <laughs> like, the, like, Fallout 76, like, up north of the map, it's all, like, toxic and shit yeah. like this. And they're, like, ghouls. Or scorched, maybe. What do you think zombies would be? More like ghouls or scorched? Ghouls. Oh, okay. Well, Your zombie friends aren't as smart as my zombie friends. <laughs> uh, we got a couple stickers. We got this Daily High Club zombie sticker. That's fucking cool as shit. We got this like Daily High Club. Look, I don't even know what the f it's like teeth and like green brains and shit. That's a really dope fucking sticker. We're gonna have to use all these stickers on something soon. We got this uh, like kind of ooze coming out of the fucking ooze stickers, and it's got like little guys in the fucking fumes and shit, or maybe the, in the ooze. <laughs> I guess it's still ooze technically. I hadn't been looking at it for very long, so don't judge me. And then we got like a super stoned out zombie. He's smoking two joints at the same damn time. This boy is crazy. That's everything you get in the box. A uh, cool box, I think. Patreons, I'll see you in a second. We'll pick either the Jokers or the Dosey Dos and we'll smoke one of those. And we'll also try out the Rice Krispie Treat and the Peanut Butter Cup because I'm very interested in both of those as well. Uh, everybody else, thank you so much for hanging out. And if you liked what you saw, maybe consider hitting up the Patreon. It's as low as a dollar. You get access to the this basically all the raw footage that was down here today because like I, as you can see we cut a bunch of shit out i fuck up talking a lot so they get a ton more stuff than you guys like the other day the video was like 15 minutes or something the patreon video was like an hour and they also get a whole bonus smoke sesh at the end where we try new things and sometimes i give them little sneak peeks at like things that we have that are coming up soon so Stay tuned and maybe think about, you know what I mean? Hit me up, patreon.com slash flipping wild. Just, just saying. Also, if you want to check out Daily High Club, check out Daily High Club. You can use my code, I think it's flipping loud or flip 10. Tried both. I forget, I forget which one works. They always tell me it's flip 10, but then they tell me that people still use the flipping loud one. And as some people have told me that the flip 10 one actually doesn't work. So who fing knows? Also, I almost forgot this part, but. Here's our Hey Abby update. So where we last left off, she had fell over, right? And I had gently placed her back into her cube and she was starting to thrive. She was actually doing really great. We tried to get some B-roll for that video, some uh, time-lapse, it did not work. We did, however, get the time-lapse stuff figured out. So we have two days worth of time-lapse that we can show you now. Also that the next day, basically, I contacted one of my grower friends, shout out to Grizzly Buds in the Discord, in the Hey Abby Discord, he's super cool. But I was basically talking to him because I felt like my plant wasn't growing very fast. After watching the footage back though, it actually was growing quite well. And I think we transplanted a little bit early, but he told me if the roots were long enough, then it was okay to transplant. And her roots were getting pretty long. I'm gonna put this out for a second. Sorry, I was in the middle of a joint when I remember that I forgot to update you guys about the Hey Abby. So after talking to Grizz, he said, it doesn't really matter how, how big she is yet because the, the Hey Abby app, so that there should be like a big set of leaves this way and a big set of leaves this way. And we weren't quite there yet, but my homie Grizz was like, hey, if her roots are long enough, which they were, they were, our roots were very long, then it was okay to transplant. And he said it might be stalling out because it's looking for nutrients and it's only finding water. So we transplanted, we took her out of the cup, we put her into the Hay Abbey, we filled it up with about three gallons, two and a half to three gallons worth of water. We dumped a half a pack of the silver nutrients in, a half a pack of the gold nutrients in per the instructions. And we let her sit in there. So apparently about at the three to four minute mark of us putting it in there, I guess we, I, I, I might've bumped her or something when I was doing something because she like all of a sudden was like fell over a little bit. And we're trying to just let her recover on her own without trying to manipulate her. But anyway, here's where we're at. Damn, my light just died <laughs> at the very end of when I was talking. 
So here's where we're at as of this moment. Here's a quick time lapse. We're still growing. Our, our, our bigger set of leaves haven't come in yet, but we're just kind of letting her do her own thing. And these are the last two days in time lapse form. Should take about a minute. Anyway, that's where we're at. So I will see you guys next Thursday. Not this Thursday, because I don't even, I don't know if we're gonna have a video this Thursday, but I also don't think it would be enough time in between for like much to happen. So we'll get back with you in exactly one week for our next Hey Abby update. I'm very excited to see where this goes. Hopefully she she's okay. We're a little worried about Lady Carl. I am. She she doesn't seem to be like leaning on like the good news is. Like she's not leaning on the the cup. She's like holding herself upright somewhat and she's still growing. So I think, I think everything's gonna be okay and I'm just freaking out. Plants, I always try to run this back as my mantra because I, I, we heard this on a YouTube video, I think. Plants are much stronger than we think they are. Just gotta let her do her own thing and she'll be cool. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the update. I'll see y'all next time, peace. Don't forget, to, there's a blooper after this screen. Yeah, I'm a Nintendo game dude. Nintendo game dude. Is this regular Nintendo? Nintendo. Nintendo game dude. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs>